In this video, we take a look at how to calculate the size of an image and a sound file. So for the exam, you need to know how to be able to calculate the size of a sound file and also the size of an image file. So as a simple summary, a sound file, we take the sample rate times by the duration of the sound file in seconds timed by the resolution of the sound file. For the size of an image, we take the color depth, that's in bits, times by the image height in pixels, times by the image width in pixels. So let's give this a go with an actual sound file we're showing here on the left. Now remember to work out the size of that sound file, we need to do the sample rate times by the duration second times by the resolution. So we'll start with the sample rate. So that's the number of times the sound file is being sampled in a second. You can see here we've got three seconds along the bottom and in each given second is being sampled six times. That's the vertical gray lines. So we have a sample rate of six, six samples being taken per second. We times that by the duration of the sound file in seconds, where we've said the sound file is three seconds long. And finally, we need to times it by the resolution. So this is the sample depth, sometimes known as the amplitude. This is the number of bits which are being captured at every single sample. You can see here there are 16 various graduations on the left hand side which the sound can be captured at. And those 16 variations can be captured in four bits from 0, 0, 0, 0 to 1, 1, 1, 1. So we have a resolution of four bits. So we end up with six times three times four, which is 72 bits. And if we divide that by eight to get bytes, this sound file is nine bytes in size. Now we cover the topic of sound in more detail in one of our other videos in this series. Finally, image files. The first thing we need to do is work out the height of the image in pixels. Well, that's 14 here. We then need the width of the image in pixels. Well, that's 17. And finally, we need to know the color depth. That's the number of bits it takes to store each pixel. Well, we've got eight colors making up this image and we can store eight different combinations with three bits from 0, 0, 0 for black here with 1, 1, 1 being white. That means every pixel is going to require three bits to store. We have a color depth of three. So what we end up with is 14 times 17 times three, which is 714 bits. And of course, if you want that in bytes, we divide by eight. So this image is taking up 90 bytes. Now we cover the topic of images in more detail in another video in this series. So just to recap, we can calculate the size of an image file by taking the color depth, multiplying by the image height in pixels, multiplied by the image width in pixels. We can calculate the size of a sound file by taking the sample rate times by the duration in seconds of that sample, times by its resolution.